game. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look, I know we've been zooming through a bunch of different boss fights and all sorts of stuff, but I have some explaining to do, so I'm gonna jump in right now. We will get back into some more of the intro style, montage style stuff, but I'm gonna talk over these couple of boss fights, these next couple, because number one, we're gonna get our first Lord of Center Kill up next after these. Deacons of the Deep, they trash, you see me man, I was just comp using those alluring skulls, I don't even know what I'm saying right now, but I did use the alluring skulls to get some free windows, then when they came back, I was like, man, he's low, I'm just gonna jump in there, but I don't know if you've been noticing through the clips, but this is actually just a easier version of the Elden Ring challenge that I did, which was club only, you know, no buffs, the only thing I'm allowed to equip other than the club itself is is rings or an elder ring case would be the talismans for uh any type of damage buffs or just other you know beneficial stuff but here's the fight against the abyss watchers so this is only phase two but the reason that i made this you know i allowed any weapon with club in the name as we progress through the game i could get a better club but i thought it would even out because compared to elden ring i've barely touched this game i've beat this game one time and i have not fought all bosses for this run i was going to do all base game bosses and beat them all with the various clubs so i wanted to try them all out but you can see by this point uh for the abyss watchers i already had the great club which was going to be my end game weapon so it kind of turned into a great club only but there was still you know at least a couple kills with each of the clubs and i like uh through the early game getting to progress upwards you know kind of improving each weapon so i finally committed to the great club but the reason i've been jumping through so quick is because i quite literally have been killing every boss in like less than probably eight attempts or less so I didn't feel the need to turn on the recording just to destroy every boss. You guys are going to see it continues into the late game. But we're going to jump back in. There's only one thing I have to say. Fuck it, we ball. Oh man, what the hell? Oh my god, no way. Yeah. Talking by. Ah! Yeah, no man, like hold on, brother. Before we get into the final, or not, why am I saying final? Okay, uh, there is one fight I actually want to break down in detail that I didn't have live con for. Before we get into the actual, you know, live con footage where we tackle any boss and area that i have not explored yet but it's the pontiff fight now this fight would have not been too bad but i never have parried this guy before so doing the opening parry you see as i after i died as i was walking up i was practicing the the open hand parry where if you unequip everything you can parry with your offhand and i didn't know the timing on it really but i did know uh you know this opening attack is not too bad you just gotta wait for him to raise the sword above his head so i was just waiting to get that i think this was actually the most attempts of any boss but once i actually did get this you can see how much crazy damage it actually did like almost half the health bar right there so literally boom it gets get the free hit after he stands up so he's already below half health by the time he gets to transition to phase two so once i got the actual timing down for the opener uh i ended up winning this very attempt you guys are gonna see but it did take me a while because i was trying to do you know i was still trying to win even if i messed up the opening parry but then i ended up taking a hit you know a lot of my strat was just trading because i didn't i like i said i thought it would counteract compared to the elden ring run because i didn't know these bosses very well so that's why i allowed myself to upgrade the club throughout but the pontiff fight was definitely one of the more difficult ones but once i figured out that timing for the first parry got the job done i got nothing else to say we're just gonna see if i'm hot and ready right now if i'm locked in or not 
This dude's on my ass. I can hear him fucking running. But he's kind of a cold boy, so we're not worried about all that. Anyways, there's a shortcut, but I don't like the bonfire that it leads to, so I'd rather just do this. about that follow up. You know, let me get some space. That's the dub bait one. Fuck, I knew that was the I knew that was the fake stagger. Oh, he missed wow. That's a bailout. And I'm an idiot. I knew that, I knew that, fuck. You like leaving me alone, right? Alright, approach me now. Yep. Go on. Look at that, easy money, bro. The club is literally just generational. Throw your, throw your nukes at me, boy. I mean, look, I mean, what can I say? We know we're only using the club, so go ahead and give me this soul. And on top of that, I mean, I got a really basic ring set up. I mean, it works for me because I don't know where any undead bone shards are in this game. I'm still at a plus four flask. Hopefully I find like one more undead bone shard, but I got a lot of health and I got a lot of flask, so it doesn't really matter. You can just create some distance and spam heal for the most part. That was good well, with you. We're going to go all strength. Hmm. 35. Farewell, Ashen One. May yep, 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 yep. I appreciate you, Bacon. I'm not allowed to use the Storm Ruler, and I don't feel like uh, fighting Lil Bro legit. So my plan is just kind of to run back there um, and see how this shit go. All right, I'm not seeing any summon signs, so let's hope Sigurd appears. Let's get it. Yep, let's go. New cutscene, baby. Look at my <laughs> look at my chin, bro. <laughs> hey, let's go, man. You gonna carry that storm roller for me, man? Cause I don't got it. Yum. And if we oh, double storm ruler, this will be trivialized. So. Of the of the <sighs> Imagine I mess up. If Sigurd dies, is he just dead? Because I feel like he might be. And I don't want to see my boy die like that. Oh my god. Look at the hands. Getting his ass beat right now. Just keep aggro. Keep aggro for my boy, you know. And then we hit the hands. Ugh. Yep, double stagger, baby. Look at how long he staggers for, bro. This shit crazy. Oh. Oh my god, he's getting clapped, bro. I'm not even locked on. Let's go, Seagward. Let's go, Seagward. Oh my god. That might have been the shortest boss fight of the game. And he lives. This is why you my goat, bro. Look, we just absolutely destroyed, bro. I didn't know hitting his hands with the club would do that much damage. Uh, that probably means I could have just beat him. Let me just eat his soul in front of you real quick. You probably wanted you probably wanted me to do this, right? You don't you don't mind that at all? I hope you don't mind. Now you said old friend, I just ate his soul in your face. 
Um, but you're a great guy, I mean, so I'm sure you understand. I'm not even gonna pick up the storm ruler, bro. Fuck that storm ruler. Look, the hand shots were doing almost 2,000 damage as is. Oh my god. Lord have mercy. <clears throat> Only thing that can kill me is that bow and arrows uh, attack. So I'm just about to send it. I mean, I ain't even worried, man. Fuck it, just send it. I'm gonna die. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I knew it, bro. Like, ooh, those arrows. Is he guaranteed to do that every time? Man, at that, I'm embering up, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> How long has that been there, bro? Uh, extra flash never hurt anybody. Hold on, bro. All right. I have a feeling that uh, Aldrich is gonna die. Oh hell no, bro! Y'all y'all tripping today? Just three casual fireball shooters over there, living life to the fullest. Like Aldrich is so sweet, bro. I'm not even worried. He literally has one attack that can do anything. And the rest is just sorry. Moonlight arrows, bro. I walked over here thinking I was going to get something good. Thinking I might get a little Titanite chunk. Look at that. My roll was so comp. He fucking got hit by it. What the fuck is that? I can't see. Like, bro, you are just so lame, dude. I can't even believe this boss exists. They really programmed this shit into the game, bro. I don't even care, bro. You can hit me all you want, bro. You're dead, buddy. Come on straight, bro. Dumbass. Die, bitch. I don't even care, bro. This boss is just terrible. <laughs> that instant damage AoE on the teleport. I mean, it's not instant. He charged it up. But, like, if you get caught in an attack, you're cooked. The arrow attack is cooked. And then he just... <laughs> Like, you can't even see. You got the relock on every time he teleports, bro. Just let me stay locked on. Even Elden Beast has the courtesy to stay locked on when he goes underwater. You teleported me here. I'm sorry to tell you, but... Um, I already killed... I already killed this boss. Should I do it? The, the wax dunk challenge? But Big Rufus, I don't know if he wants any part of that. But you know what? I think I, I think I gotta do the wax dunk challenge, man. God dang. He's here, oh my god. Please don't try. Please don't. What the heck? You have a grab attack, cuh? I didn't even know you were here. Just good, wasn't he? Hey man, you just told me that like five minutes ago. And I'm not in good health at all. I just got beat upon by seven enemies. Anyways. Boom, boom, and we all know this is the first area, but the first area is no longer as welcoming. It's fallen into a state of darkness. What the, what the hell, bro? Oh, there is a dog. They're all one shot. Bro, these dudes are just... Why are y'all trying to fight me, bro? Y'all were just taking a bet. I don't even want to be here, bro. I just don't. I'm just going to run for it. Whoa, that's... That's a crazy... Dude, 
His moveset is beautiful. Oh, he's got a grab attack. I don't know when to hit him without trading. Yeah, his moveset is count. We'll give it a quick run with uh, the Ember. But it looks like I'm gonna have to actually learn. Yeah, I wanna duke it out with my day one home. And I'm still cooked because my jump button is mapped. I hate that move already. I've only seen it two times. That's definitely a window. Okay, that might be a window. That's a window. It's like it's a slow up. Nothing's a window. Nothing is as it seems. No, that's not even a grab attack. He's just punching me, bro. He's punching and kicking out here, bro. He said, "Let's let's run the hands, bro." Whoa, that's a devious hitbox, bro. Got me shook, bro. Ah. Uh. You know, you can punch me. Out. Oh, there is a grab attack. I live this. I live this. I live this. Oh my god. I, I thought it was clickbait. I thought it was clickbait, bro. Calm down, bro. Calm down, bro. Do something fun. Trade. Oh my god! The grab attack wasn't clickbait. But I'm embered, baby. I was trying to learn windows. I look up. And he's like one shot. So you know what I'm saying? That lives that leaves a lot bigger of a window. Does this take me to the dark fire link? Imagine wait, wait, wait. Hold on, bro. Imagine. Wait, wait, wait. I have to do it now. There's no way there's anything up here. Because you're not even supposed to be able to get up here. But now I have to... I'm already feeling like I'm in a place I shouldn't be. Maybe I'm trash at the tree jump, though. Hold on. Or is the tree is the tree slightly different, you know? Oh, no, it's not. Hold on, bro. We got that. Unless there's an invisible wall. Sight. It's free, bro. It's free. There's not going to be anything up here. Because I don't think they ever intended for you to be up here, but if it's the same layout, I'm gonna exploit that layout. You know what I'm saying? Top ten places the developers did not intend on the player reaching. Number five. So I'm gonna grab that item. It's a cool little blade that I can't use, but. Maybe I'll do some new Game Plus playthroughs with this character. I picked up a lot of stuff. Unlimited use homeward bone? Bro, what? Are we serious? Why did I even try it? Why did I even try it? I seen what enemy it was. <laughs> I knew what enemy it was. <laughs> I knew that... I had already done half the run. I knew it was behind a hidden wall, and I still tried it. Uh, I'm having fun. I'm having fun. I mean, it's almost like no one could ever guess why I don't like this area of the game. You know? No one, no one could ever guess it. You know? No one could ever guess it. There's nothing here. It's just for the cinematic shot, bro. They're acting like I know how to get to the shortcut from here, man. I might just be cooked. Oh, well. Never mind. We're about to see the cutscene. We're about to see this boss for the first time in a while. 
And hopefully we're about to do the first live com kill of these boys. Let me be at full force for these guys. To, oh, I just forgot. I forgot to use the undead bone shard. I'm not going to first try these guys. There's just no way. So, let's see it. Let's see it. I'm going to do the bone shard if, oh once, <laughs> if I die. Let's let's not let's not keep it out of the question. You know, there's a possibility. Holy mo- <laughs> I can't believe I just ducked under both those attacks, bro. The club light attacks might be comp for that. What the fuck? I could have dodged it. Did I just- oh, I'm alive. I'm alive. Three swings? Four? Four swings in a row is crazy. Man, give me that bone shard. They're getting worked. I'm gonna give it six attempts. We're doing a uh, we're doing an over under at six, and it's gonna be a minus two fifty odds. Um, uh, I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Let's be honest, I don't even know what I'm saying. Um, burn shard. I'm getting... Bro, how many does it spawn? How many does it spawn, bro? Phase one is sweet like candy. Phase two, on the other hand... I sold, bro. I know he teleports after that most of the times, dude. What? I was out of stamina. Oh no, I'm cooked. Spam roll. I lived. What? Let's go, bro. I told y'all I promised the under. They try to they try to cheese me by I killed the and then they get to teleport across the arena. Come on, bro. That's a bucket. Everybody who pick under, I know y'all bet on me because I know y'all have faith in me. And you've seen how these Unga Bunga strats are really great, okay? Now this is greatness in car. I'm not talking about clubbing, but you know what I mean. All I know is the life of the club. And the club and me, I love the club and the club loves me. Okay? So I want y'all to understand that before y'all even think of talking crazy on me or betting the over on me. Alright, anybody who took the over six with yeah, parlays are cooked. This. Get their ashes, you know, these boys. They all they all said they wanted to get cremated, so that's cool. We're gonna respect their wishes, you know. Um and we're gonna do that right now. Look at this dude, bro. He got no, he skipped leg day. He always skips leg day. But look at the, like, 
I mean, when you're just swinging a club around, you know, you don't need legs for that. You just need the upper body. All right, so as we all know, if we run all the way up there, we'll be at the final, the final boss of the game, which this build might first try. I'm not going to lie. So let's go see how bad Nameless King is going to be and see if we can finish this up tonight or if we're going to call it a night. Everybody knows that this dude has a cutscene, right? There is no way Nameless King doesn't have a cutscene, bro. Let's do this. King of the Storm, no cutscene. This has a cutscene, though. <laughs> ah. All right, so camera is cooked on phase one. That's my first ever fight review. Um, I just killed his pet, though, so he's about to go John Wick on me. Um, this is the true test. No, don't, don't make it worse. Oh my god! But you had to unlock the powers. I can't believe I made you do that to your pet bird, bro. I'm sorry, bro. I mean, you came at me crazy. You know this? <laughs> yeah. I didn't even roll, because I was just, like, looking at the spectacle. Bro has the fire giant attacks. All right, yeah, we're not, we're not doing this thing. And I'll leave y'all today with this <laughs> there's no sound on that bro the hip hip hooray type type beat uh, so I guess if there's no sound I leave y'all today with this how to get some rest man so it is about time that we wrap this up if you've made it this far I appreciate you and you know if you made it to the end of the video, consider subscribing. I try to make videos like this. Uh, I try to make videos once a week, but you know, I'm a, I'm somewhat of a busy man, uh, even though it may not seem like it. Uh, but you know, I did not I'll be in the Nameless King the next day as well as the final boss, which I'll show up next. But yeah, if you enjoyed, you made it this far to the end, consider subscribing. Nobody that watches my videos is really subscribed for real. I could put the stat of, you know, the classic YouTuber trope with the little screenshot of the subscribe versus not subscribe, but I'm not going to do that. I just want to marvel at this somewhat immaculate uh, Nameless King fight that I had. Uh, I really was not getting hit that much. I figured out the rhythm of this fight pretty fast. It definitely took a lot of attempts. This was probably the, the actual most attempts because phase one was annoying too. Not Pontiff, but... Yeah, between those two, it was one of those two for sure, which I feel like are the ones, the bosses that give people the most struggle. But this run was super fun, so I hope you guys did enjoy um, as I do get the kill on Nameless King right there. Now, I will say, obviously, it wasn't as much of a challenge run as the Elden Ring version or some of the other ones that I've done. But it was really because I did not expect to be cooking this much with the... Um, uh, with the Dark Souls 3 bosses like I ended up doing so with that being said this will only just get me ready for future runs if I do continue down this path I might try to do a soul level 1 run because you know I've been doing the rune level 1 on Elden Ring so we'll just have to see where this takes us but I was happy to get the dub against Nameless King and then I was finally ready to wrap things up and get the final boss dealt with you know uh what's his name solo sender anyways i'm just gonna let this play out i got the end game audio for y'all I, I did not have the mic plugged in though so i'm gonna let y'all enjoy this final boss
try walking in those shoes. <laughs> hey, first of all, baby, I got <laughs> enough meat on me that it's all right. Fitness be the all the plug is number right next to the BB. Me and Brody smoked a QB, should we toast it like panini? This ain't ordinary pasta, had the lobster on the wing. Run up in this mansion, I'ma leave it haunted like Louis.